people good morning to you all as you can see i am very tired <laughs> i am going to take a shower and i thought it would be fun to show you guys what i always use here i have my hair product and i am a huge fan of the john frieda collection and what i always use is uh well not always these are just my favorites i like the root awakening shampoo and conditioner but for today, I'm going to leave the conditioner out because I have a uh, deep conditioner that I'm going to use today with this shampoo. This shampoo is very good at cleaning your hair and re really getting your roots cleaned and giving that strength back in your hair. But my hair is also very frizzy. So I decided to use this and um, this is the first time I'm going to use a deep conditioner so I'm very excited and I'm very curious how it's going to turn out and if it works well but if I just take normal showers I will just use these two in the bath and also I have my favorite showering shower gel ever which is from Palmolive I like these these are the aroma sensations and you have a lot of different uh, scents and the blue one I like the most but this one I like a lot too so I'm going to use that as well just give myself a pamper session really. I hope you can hear me because I put the shower on and I and it's very loud <laughs> And I forgot to show you guys that I'm also going to use this face scrub. I bought a new face scrub. I always use a gel face scrub. But now I find found a face scrub that's cream. So I really want to know if this is going to be very helpful. Just got out of the shower. And as always, I put my hair up in a towel. This bathroom smells so so good right now. I was just getting out of the uh, shower and I sniffed it and I was like, oh my god, this is some fresh goodness because I only love fresh scents and I always use things with fresh scents and my bathroom just smelled amazing and fresh. Just, just like you've stepped out into like a flowery field or whatever. But my face is very dry now because of the face scrub. I'm not really sure if I like that face scrub because I used another one which I really, really, really liked. And I couldn't find it. So I bought that one instead that I just showed you guys. And then I went shopping with Afa um, Monday. And I found it again. And... Here it is, but I already bought the other one, so I wanted to try that one. But I'm not sure if I really like it, because the smell, first of all, smelled just very chemical. And it didn't really feel like it was cleaning my face. It felt like it was more of a sort of moisturizer, but as soon as I rinsed it off, my face did feel soft, but it didn't really feel moisturized. So I am going to put some moisturizer on my face and see if I like it or not. The deep conditioner, though, is the first time I'm using something like that. I think I will enjoy because I put it in my hair and just felt so soft. And I let it in there for like three to five minutes and then I rinsed it off. My hair just felt so smooth and silky. So I hope I will like that one. But yeah, I'm going to put some moisturizer on my face, like I said. And then I'm going to eat because I'm very, very, very hungry. I also have to clean my room because it's quite a mess. So yep. Yeah. Just came downstairs to eat also. My face is very shiny now because I moisturized it. <laughs> and I put my glasses on. Because if, if I do not put my glasses on, I will not be able to see anything at all. But I just came downstairs to eat something. And I have no idea what I want to eat. I have that every morning. That I'm very hungry. But we don't really have anything that I really want to eat. And I do not really know what I want to eat. Which is a good thing to start with. Uh, why is this so hard? Okay, I found salmon uh, in the freezer, so I'm going to wait till this uh, is not frozen anymore. You know, and in the meantime, I am going to eat a fruit salad with apple, tangerine, and banana. <laughs> and don't worry, I'm just going to eat one banana, not the whole thing. So let me do that. Let's start my day off with very healthy things. 
Oh my god, and do you know what I just realized? That it expires on my birthday, which is 15th of December 2015. Yay! I wanted to eat my uh, fruit with yogurt, but then I opened our uh, fridge and all I saw was milk and milk. So that's not cool. I'll just have to eat it like this. Yep. Do you know what I've been wanting for a very long time? A Nutri Bullet. Because I see it everywhere and it looks so easy. You just put everything in there that you want with a little bit of juice and water. And then it just makes an amazing smoothie and I love smoothies. So maybe I should buy a Nutri Bullet. Maybe I should do that. And that will also help me eating more vegetables and eating more, well, drinking more vegetables and more fruit. Because a lot of times I don't really have time to, you know, cut fruit like this because I have to work and such. So it will be handy that whenever I'm free I can just make like smoothies, store it in the fridge, store it in the, I can't talk to get today, store it in the fridge and then take it with me or drink it in the morning. I don't mind. So I really want to buy a nutri bullet. I'm going to search how expensive it is. Let me do that. Oh my god. The cheapest one is a hundred euros. I did not see that one come in. I expected it to be uh, cheaper, way cheaper. I was thinking maybe in the 60, 70 euros, but a hundred? And the most expensive one is a hundred and fifty. No way I'm going to do that. I would have to earn a lot of money to pay for that. Oh my god. Let me just I don't know, buy a book instead and how to use it, I guess. <laughs> oh my god. I am just going through pictures on this uh, iPad. This is like the family iPad. Everyone goes on this iPad and does everything what they want on it. Like play games, make photos, watch videos, whatever. And I was going through the photos while eating my um, fruit. And I came across one that I really wanted to share with you guys. I am just very attractive for a time. <laughs> I was going through the pictures and I just like saw a video of my little brother with my knees and then I saw what my mom made and then I, went, and then I saw this one I was like why but okay <laughs> and having an iPad is not complete without having the classic photo booth photos this is me with my niece look how cute we are aren't we just the cutest people ever yeah <laughs> I can't open the door all. <laughs> Use your muscles. Use it. It's gonna work. Yay! Look who just came home. Hi. <laughs> My little brother introduced me to this game, Piano Tiles 2. I already played Piano Tiles 1 a lot. And I'm kind of obsessed. Oh, ships. But I want to play it. One-handed. Do you want to accept the challenge? Oh. Okay. I'm going first, one-handed, and then my little brother is going to play one-handed and see who has the most, the most points. Okay, start. I thought it would be appropriate to play Jingle Bells because it's reaching Christmas. And my little brother is now going to hold the camera for me. Yes? Okay, one-handed. Let's start. Wait, let me position this right. Okay, I've got 142, was it? Yeah, 142. Now it's your turn. Go, go, go.
I won, I won, I won. I won, no! <laughs> That's not fair. While he's trying it again, I won because I got 142 and this dude got a 93. Yay! Me and my little brother are also very obsessed with this game, which is called Dragon City. I saw it in the app store and I really wanted to play it. So I told my little brother that we should download it here on this iPad. At first he was like, oh no, I'm already playing it. I don't like it. Why would you download it? But I downloaded it anyway. And we started a island anyway. And now he's loving it. And I am too. Oh. It's just the amazing little dragon. It's just a nice and fun game. So yeah. That's what I wanted to share with you guys. I cleaned my room. All I need to do now is vacuum it. And we have the biggest vacuum cleaner ever. Oh, the light isn't working anymore. Oh, it is. <laughs> and uh, what was I saying? Oh, right. That we have the biggest vacuum cleaner ever, which is this one. And I think it's from the year uh, 1970 or something because it's so big and so heavy. And it's the only vacuum cleaner that we have. It is a very good vacuum cleaner. It does what it has to do, which is vacuuming. But it's so heavy and every time when I need to take it downstairs, I'm so afraid that I'm going to fall and break my neck. Um, it's also quite an uh, arm workout. So let me just... Just grab this big old boy. Oh god, that is so heavy. It's ridiculous. Whew. Let me start vacuuming. And all that fake snow that I showed you guys yesterday has to go because it's such a mess. I vacuumed everything and it's such a nice feeling to have everything like smooth and clean and there is no fake snow lying underground. So, so, so happy. Everything looks perfect now. Yes, finally. And now I can blow dry my hair because I've had my uh, hair in a towel for a very long time. Maybe it's even, even dried like this. But I'm going upstairs because we don't have a blow dryer downstairs. My mom has like the best blow dryer ever. And she keeps it in her room. So I'm going to blow dry my hair there. And yeah, then I'll see what I do. Today is a very homey day and I like it. Don't have to do anything. I think later on I'm going to edit uh, the video that they and I filmed yesterday or the day before that. The day before that, which was... Was it Wednesday? Yeah, Wednesday. I'm going to edit that, I think. Hey, people! I'm just sat in my bed with my laptop and I was just editing the video that Davey and I filmed two days back. Um, I took a little break and I watched some videos and I also wanted to watch a movie, but then I realized that I have another Google Hangout... Whoa, I said that very weird. Another Google Hangout in like 40 minutes. So I decided to scrap that and just continue editing in a bit. And um, today was just a very homey day, so I didn't really do a lot. And uh, I think I'm going right to bed after um, the Google Hangout because I have to work half past six tomorrow. And I have to wake up early again. So I want to go to bed very early. Um, so I thought... I would end my video here because there isn't a lot of things that I can show you guys now. The only thing that I'm going to do is continue editing until I have the Google Hangout and then I am going to have the Google Hangout for an hour and go to sleep. And that's kind of boring showing you guys. So I want to say good night for the people that, go, that are going to sleep or good morning, good afternoon, whatever time you're watching this. And yeah. I guess I will see you guys tomorrow again. Another day of vlogging. Bye.